What is good and welcome back. In this episode, we will be playing our third game of the season and it is going to be a good one. Now, we are taking on the Cleveland Browns and... Well, you guys know the Cleveland Browns are not a good team, but every battle in the NFL is a battle. Every fight is a fight. And we're going to have to play really well to get this W. Now, make sure you guys do subscribe to the channel if you have not. And also hit the thumbs up button. And let's get into it right here. You guys do see my stats in the first two games, and I have 20 tackles. 20 tackles means I have 10 per game average. I'm not exactly how many I had the first game or the second game, but yes, 20 tackles. That is a lot uh, for two games. You guys see I also have two sacks in the season. No interceptions. I have some pass deflections, um, but I do not have any defensive touchdowns. But you guys do see three forced fumbles in two games. So I am playing very well. Cannot wait to get into this third game. And uh, hopefully we get another victory. Now my defense is one of the top defenses in the league, if not the number one defense so let's see how we do here and can we stop the Cleveland Browns Now let's get into it right here and already I am on a tackle and we do hit the receiver hard enough to where he drops the ball which means it is an incomplete pass and you guys already know don't cross the middle it is the danger zone once again I am here and we are here for a gang tackle to bring down the receiver and our defense is too nice we are everywhere on the field third and ten right here quarterback drops back and throws a screen screens are very hard to stop and as you guys do see he picks up a first down and that was a very very good pickup a lot of yards right there um, for the running back on that screen the quarterback drops back one more time and i am there for another tackle a wrap-up tackle and i brought him down fourth and inches they are going to punt the ball they're gonna take no chances because they already know how this defense rocks and we rock just like that javillion clowny how do you say his name javillion 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 clowny i'm gonna just say clowny and you guys see the instant replay and boom right after the quarterback right there and the man is a beast straight from south carolina columbia and you already know this defense is all over the field right here and once again another one of our top players jj Watt with the tackle and there is nowhere for you to go nothing for you to do and a pick a pick six it is a sack by county a tackle by Watt, and then a pick six right there and this defense is nasty man hit that thumbs up for this defense and you guys see the instant replay right here first of all the browns have a rookie quarterback once again another quarterback to add to the list a pick and then the six and we are doing it big All right, second and two in the second quarter. The score is 14 to zero, by the way. So the offense is playing very, very well. And the ball is bombed deep, but the defender right there, the cornerback, or was that the safety? One or the other pass deflected, and that was not an incomplete, or that was not a complete pass, excuse me. The last one was first and 10. Ball is thrown across the middle, and there they go. The Cleveland Browns are marching. Quarterback is in the backfield, taking his own sweet time, and that is a sack. Nowhere for him to go, nowhere for him to throw. Third and 14, a long way to go. They make it to fourth and eight, so they're gonna take a field goal right here before the half to make the score hopefully 14 to three. And yes, that's what they did. 14 to three is the score. They are down by 11. Still a long way to go for them to get back into this game. Uh, but the defense is still playing well. I don't mind giving up three points as long as we're up and uh, we're not giving touchdowns. So here we go again. And now they keep marching down the field. That is a first down. So they do end up getting in field goal range once again. 14-3. Can they make it 
14 to 6 to cut the score and they just sneak it in right in the right post before it even hit the post and a very good job by them so 14 to 6 is now oh a lot 17 to 6 is now the score and you guys see i'm going after the running back at all costs i'm very elusive very agile and i'm able to move left to right and get where i need to go to get to the running back now you guys do see we are doing our thing third and six ball is thrown and a first down we cannot be giving the first down they are only down by 11 points um sounds like a lot but if they score soon they have a chance to maybe score again that is a tackle again by myself uh, assisted tackle right there now the quarterback goes short again and he loves to throw the ball short and that was a big time tackle in front of the first down marker third and one what are they going to do the ball is handed off oh oh spin moves and he picks up the first down for his squad the running back is having himself a good day. And down goes the quarterback again. So much is going on in the backfield right there. So this means three field goals. Haven't given up any touchdowns. Kick is up. Kick is going to be good straight down the middle. 17-9. Uh, to nine. Right now is the score. Comment down below. Let me know how many points I'm up by. Let me see your guys' math. I know. Oh. Just like that, low juke, and they are moving it. But yes, let me see you guys' math down below. I know you're out of school right now, so I got to keep your mind sharp. And another pass down the field. What are we doing under a minute left? Watch out for the deep bomb. Watch out for the, I, I called it. Watch out for the deep bomb, and that's a pick. Right there, we do what we got to do. And what we got to do is intercept the ball, and that is game. No way back after this. I will probably kneel the ball. Well, the offense will kneel the ball. And that will be game. Let's check out the instant replay right here. And you guys see the rookie quarterback bombs it deep. Takes a chance. But there was three guys around the receiver. And we do get the interception. Which means the game is over. And we did our thing. Let's go. So just like that. The game is over. We did kneel the ball, and we are victors once again. 3-0 so far in the season. 17-9 is the final score. We did not give up a touchdown today. Now, rate my team down below, guys. Rate how the defense played 1 through 10. I give us about a, I'll say a 7 because I think our defense is one of the top, so I'll be critical. We gave up three field goals, so I say a 7. We gave them no touchdowns, though, so that is very, very good. Here are the post-game stats, and you guys see we led in rushing yards. We did not have a good amount of passing yards today, but it's okay. Uh, we still got the victory. Two takeaways as well. Now, you guys do see some stats right here. I did not lead the game in tackles, but I did have seven, one less than the leaders uh, on my team. Didn't have any interceptions, did not force a fumble. So not one of my better games, but I still had an all right one. And we got the victory, which is all I care about. It's all about the team, you know what I'm saying? Not really about the individual stats. Unless I play very, very well, then of course you have to reward yourself, you know what I'm saying? And pat yourself on the back. So in week four, we are taking on the two and one. Buffalo Bills. Hopefully we can play well again and hopefully we can get the dub now I'm going to be adding something to these player career series. Uh, it's gonna be very very cool Just a little spice to it and it's something that I used to do uh, Like a year ago in my videos and I kind of stopped But if you guys have an idea comment it down below and let me know what you guys think I'm gonna add to these player careers I'm gonna drop another one this week. Maybe actually in a couple days. It might be my next video actually because uh, I want to move through these. I'm going to move forward. I want to get to uh, the playoffs very soon. So let me know what y'all think. Hope you guys did enjoy. If you guys did, hit that thumbs up and stay tuned. We're 3-0. The Jags are 2-1. Tennessee is 2-1. The Colts are 0-3. We have a good chance of making the playoffs. Let's go. Stay tuned. And I am out.